after having a little bit of trouble hearing Scott tonight. We can tell you he is facing six counts of illegally advising criminal defendants. Reportedly, he will face another charge of resisting arrest. All of this surrounding claims that Smith was telling criminal defendants how to beat charges in the same courthouse where he prosecutes them. Now, again, these are our exclusive, exclusive images of his arrest. He was taken to the Raymond Detention Center before he was released and then apparently snuck out a side exit there. This case is under investigation also by the FBI. They have revealed the allegations took place between January and June. The charges are misdemeanors, but they are serious. And if he is convicted, Robert Smith must leave office. We heard from some of his supporters today. Highly outraged, which uh, at this attempt to, uh, to denigrate the integrity of this office. Well, supporters claim that since Smith filed charges against state investigators in another case, they believe this is simply political payback, uh, that one of the investigators who was subpoenaed to testify was the one who took him into custody. Smith is out of jail tonight on his own recognizance. Uh, he did release a statement. It reads, in part, these misdemeanor allegations are not only false, but designed to denigrate the credibility of the Hines County District Attorney. You can read the rest of his statement as well as the list of charges he is facing on our website tonight at WAPT.com.